We are ready and set up for some live music in our studio, so we want to welcome the band Still Corners. Thank you for coming in this afternoon. Hi. They are playing this evening at the Sunset, and they have a new album out on Sub Pop called Creatures of an Hour. We'll find out a little bit more about that and how that came together, and they're going to perform a couple of songs. Thank you. 
Live music here at 90.3 KEXP. You're listening to Still Corners, and that was the song I wrote in Blood. Their new album, Creatures of an Hour. And again, they're playing this evening at the sunset over in Ballard. Thanks again for coming in. Um, let's see. I'm not sure if everybody's got a microphone. Tessa, do you want to just go ahead and introduce the band to the uh, listeners? Sure. So um, <clears throat> we have Luke, who's playing bass and keys, Greg on the drums, and Leona on guitar. All right, again, thanks for coming in. And uh, you're based in London, but I want to start with Greg, because, Greg, you're, you're actually the American who left the country because you want to go play music in London. Yeah, I was going to university, and I graduated, and I, and I thought, okay, I'll, I'll go to New York. But I met an English girl, so I moved to, to London. And that didn't work out, but I ended up staying there because I built up a life and stuff. So, yeah, so I'm there now. So where did you go to school here? Where did you where did you grow up in the U.S.? Uh, Austin and uh, Arizona. Okay, so um, a little bit of music here didn't quite work out. Went to London, and you met Tessa. Yeah. And yeah. did you have any music things going on before you met her? Once you got over there. Well, well, actually, I had kind of released the CP like around 2008, and uh, I wanted to form a band, so I met Leon, and. Uh, and he brought Luke with him, and we kind of started doing um, Still Corner stuff out. But look, we were looking for a vocalist for a while, and then it was one cold January night, and I was trying to get to London Bridge, and I got on a train, and it, and it went past London Bridge and dropped me off at Kidbrook. And this other person got out and came up to me, and it was Tessa, and she was like, did you get on the wrong train? And I was like, yeah. And then what happened? <laughs> <clears throat> and then we got talking, and... Saw each other again, and then... You said you were missing choir. Oh, yeah, I told him I was missing choir, and I think he was like, oh, she sings. But it took about two years after that before I actually joined the band. Yeah. <laughs> we started working on demos together, Yeah. and about a year later, we were like, yeah, it makes sense. So. Had you been in any bands before, Tessa? No, I'd only sung in choirs. <laughs> hmm. All so right. It was a... a quick learn for me i think yeah. <laughs> so greg you mentioned that uh, some of the demos and you before this album the last few years you had a few singles and eps and then finally this album came yeah. together now you're, you're primarily the main songwriter as well is that mm -hmm. correct yep yeah so uh how did you for you how did you know when it was ready to uh make a full album um well i think after you know working with tessa for a while it kind of became obvious like okay this is cool we should do this and so we had kind of done about, I don't know, 15 songs, and, and we just chose our, our favorite 10 and, and said, let's you know, do this record. Yeah. 
Well, the one you did right there, I wrote in Blood, and I was just asking the band right before uh, we started on air. Um, you were in Vancouver last night, so mm -hmm. Halloween, you dressed up, it was great. And then yep. You've got a little bit of Halloween and the song title, and certainly the keyboard sound is, brings yeah. that element as well. Yeah, it's a great time, you know, October, to do Still Corners music. It's quite autumnal. Yeah. Now, I've read that you've had a lot of film influence in the music. Um, are you writing songs and then kind of thinking of how do we put that to film afterwards, or does it kind of correlate together along the way? It's more kind of like there's certain <clears throat> movies and directors that use music in their films, like David Lynch uses Battle of Mente and and uh, John Carpenter does his music, and it kind of creates a kind of a vibe and atmosphere. And uh, it's more or less just sort of trying to capture that vibe and put it into the music, okay. really. Is it Luke or Leon who's involved in a lot of the, the film part of it? Yeah, Leon does all the projections for the projections shows. for the show as well that people will see tonight at the sunset. Yes, Excellent. All right. Um, how did the uh, so this album's on Sub Pop from right here in Seattle? And um, how did that come together? Well, we did a we did a video called Wish um, that was directed by Lucy Dyson, and and uh, I just noticed once when checking my email that Susan from Sub Pop, hi Susan, I can see you. <laughs> <laughs> she had uh, she had bought it and then sent sent us an email and said, Hey, I like your stuff. Let's Let's talk, and so we started talking, and the rest is rock and roll. Yeah, I found out all these people here today are all sub pop people coming in here. So <laughs> we had there's trick or treating in the office here yesterday, and I'm sure there's still a little bit left around in the offices in the building if uh, if the sub pop folks want to go trick or treating in the office. Yeah, yeah. all right, we'll do that. All right, so what kind of um, what kind of um, plans, if any, in the near future or looking into next year that you got going on? You just want to sort of keep this going. Yeah, and we're going to tour more, hopefully, a lot more. Yeah, we're, we're coming back in December with um, War on Drugs doing some more dates. Unfortunately, not the West Coast, but um, over... East Coast. Yeah, East Coast way. Yeah, they were just here last week. <coughs> oh, cool. Yeah. Yeah, they're great. All right, uh, Still Corners, the new sub-pop album, Creatures of an Hour, and performing tonight at the Sunset in Ballard. And I think you're ready for one more?
right. Nice little cover tune performed by Still Corners here at KEXP. Thanks for coming in. Again, the new album, Creatures of an Hour, performing tonight at the Sunset in Ballard. Enjoy the rest of your time here on this nice afternoon. I want to say thanks to our engineer, Kevin. It's 90.3 KEXP Seattle.